Hi, I'm Lucy Hall, and welcome to the Daily News. Tonight you're going to be seeing, seeing news reports and weather reports from all over the world. Hi, I'm Bob Bob, and welcome to End of the World Weather. Today in Antarctica, it is very hot, 150 degrees for some odd reason. So it doesn't exist anymore. But Australia, in Australia, it's minus 7 billion degrees. And in China, it's six trillion degrees. Um, and Brazil, not very. It's quite more normal than all the rest in Brazil. It's, I think, five degrees. And. New Zealand is 10 degrees and that's all that's all I've got today Welcome to the Greek mythology news I am Leia Yesterday Poseidon and Athena had a little argument one of the villages has been waiting for a long time for a god to look after them to look after them. John is on the ground to tell us more. Athena and Poseidon both wanted the job, so Poseidon pointed his three headed spear on the ground. A river appeared. When Athena told the villagers to taste the water, imagine their shock when they found out that it was salty water. People were not happy. Next, it was Athena's turn. Her gift was an olive tree. The, the villagers liked Athena more, so they picked her. Back to you, Leia. Thank you, John. We hope you enjoyed the Greek mythology news. Have a good evening. Welcome to Pointless News. Today, local farmer Greg has finally learned how to plant potatoes and the villagers can finally eat. Now, there's at least one villager born from a mother who was not in part, who was not who did not survive long enough to be able to eat potatoes. News says that farmer Greg always knew how to grow potatoes but he never shared his potatoes with other people. Other people say that he didn't know how to grow potatoes and Demeter, the Greek goddess of the harvest, came and planted potatoes. That's it. Hello. And this is Dusty coming to you live from Islington, London, reporting on an incident that occurred in Shoreditch Park late this morning. We heard from witnesses that there was a small white puppy that found a deceased black crow at the entry of Shoreditch Park. The puppy was seen trying to drag the crow from the entry way as its humans screamed in terror. The puppy was quickly apprehended and the humans have been able to access support from friends and family. The puppy was last seen cuddling his chew toys and has, not in, and has not been impacted by the situation. This story is continuing to develop and we will keep you updated. Hello and welcome to YATI News. Today's top, st top stories are Milk prices double in the last year. Climate change protests um, go on. But today's top story is, is Mauna Kea really taller than Mount Everest? More on this is Billy. I'm here in Hawaii next to Mauna Kea, which is, as you can see, 
is not very tall. But if I show you the water, it seems to go on forever. Back to John in the studio. Thank you for that, Billy. But here we have Dave disputing the fact that Mount Achaea is actually taller than, than Mount Everest. This is what he has to say. Quack. That was so inspirational, Dave. So do you believe, Dave, that Mount Achaea is really taller than Mount Everest? Or is Mount Everest taller than Mount Achaea? Thank you. Hi, and, with, and welcome to the weekly update. Today we will be looking at the weather. I'm just receiving some news and here we go. Um, across the UK, streets are flooded with coronavirus people. In the US, there have been protests and Donald Trump has been banning people, arresting them. And then in Australia, there is apparently a monkey who stole some blood tests and then took it to their own house and now they're all getting infected. See you next week on Weekly Updates. Hello, my name is Samantha Lewis and today we will be talking about Alexa. Alexa, tell me a joke. What type of weather do zombies like most? Cloudy with a chance of rain. <laughs> Alexa, when's your birthday? It's my birthday on oh. the 6th of November. It's the day after bonfire night, making it easy to remember, remember. And that's all for today. Okay, this is Marcus Jones' talk. Our top story today is that... The planet is being invaded by aliens. Yeah, that's right. Aliens! They came here. I gotta go in my book. Bye-bye. Ah, ah. Hello, and welcome to the weekly 100% trustworthy, trustworthy news with David with David. Okay, so now we're gonna, you can see Glasgow, and it is very hot weather. You have to have shorts, and very, very hot. It's very hot weather for Russia. Very, very hot weather for Russia. Because uh, you know Glasgow's in Russia. And now that we look at Brazil. Brazil, it is snowing in Brazil. And it doesn't normally snow in Brazil. So that is a bit strange, well, ex excuse me. It doesn't work. Okay. Uh, okay, now we're looking at China. Now, China, China has, China has normal weather, but in China today, it, it, it's, it's decent weather, but it is very, very cold for the continent of North America, because China's in North America. You know that, don't you? So, yes, thank you. And that's your weekly report on the news um, of the weather. Thank you. Game of Throw and there is quite a lot of news that is lo that is about people getting sucked into the game of Minecraft. Minecraft Unicorn goes missing and people are getting addicted to the game and because they're all getting addicted they are all getting sucked into the game and turning all blocky and I don't know how but like I can't even get out. I, I, I think it might be a dream or something. I don't exactly know. But that's it for me on the Minecraft news. Good, e good night. Wasn't that some incredible news and weather? See you next week.